Boo. Hello. Okay. My voice is working. Everything is working. <laughs> I have a moment every stream now where it's like right before I start, I'm like, or right as I start, I'm just like, please work. Please everything work. And it seems like we're good. Yeah, I, I'm like so paranoid about something going wrong now. I, I sound check stuff and then I started the stream and then I was like, wait, what if this isn't working? And then I stopped the stream and then I sound checked that and I was like, okay, that's working. So we're, we're good, I think. Um, let me read the announcement. It says, Days of Bloom starts today. Enjoy a tranquil moment with friends and family, or friendly spirits, friends and family. <laughs> Beneath the falling petals of the hidden forest, unlock or purchase items by talking to the event spirit guides who also offer free spell versions so you can try them beforehand. Hee <laughs> hee, I just spent 200 candles on the Blue <laughs> Cosmetics. <I know. laughs> yep, that's that's gonna be me in a minute, Lifeblood. I, I feel that in my soul. I feel the pain already. Now you're you're gonna you're gonna get to see in real time the um because I haven't been on since the new day reset. So it's going to be like, here are your seasonal candles converted into normal candles. And then I'm going to be like, yay, a hundred more candles. And then I'm going to immediately spend them. <laughs> so here, here we go. That's, that's what's going to happen. It's it's painful, but at the same time, I'll, I'll be happy to at least know that I can afford it. Whoa, look at that. Yay, converted to that. The travelers will return. Yay, a hundred candles just for me. Yay. Yay. Wow. Oh my god, I have exactly 400 candles. Hi, lifeblood. Wow, I did not plan that. Oh, I like this. It's so pretty. I guess this is where the event is going to be. They're letting you know very clearly. I like it, that's cute. Oh no, Golden Wasteland. Not Golden Wasteland. Aw, oh, hi Lifeblood. Oh, that was a thing. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the hug and for the mission. Oh yay, we got the boat. The boat is here. Um, I think this usually means that they're selling stuff in the store. Oh, you can get those too. I'm gonna hold off on that. Oh, here are- okay. Well, here are a couple free spells. We get this spell. We get this spell. Hi, Ikea man. I have a pet possum. I named him Apple. What? Oh, I think I saw you left like a message in this game about that, right? And like one of the floating boats over here. Your friend has a possum? Yeah, or roommate. Took in a baby possum, but now it's their pet. I'm obsessed with it already. I want to name them Apple. I guess you got your wish. Pet possum. For a very short amount of time, I uh, volunteered at a wildlife rescue center. And we were, were rescuing orphan possums. It's called the Possum and Pals Program. And we learned how to hold hold the babies. They had a thing, it's called the backpack method, where you're supposed to put your hand on their back. Um, as if your hand is a backpack. And, uh, you know, put your fingers around their, around their little hands. Or their little arms. So they can't move their, uh, they can't turn their heads around to bite you. And they also can't, like, scratch you. Whoa! 
Was it like an injured possum? Or what? what's the story with the possum? Responded to it. I said thank you so much for sharing it. It's super cute. I'm so glad you did it. You didn't have to do it because I, uh, because I asked you to. Or because I was curious to see if you would. But I appreciate it. Well, alright. Hi. <laughs> you came in an interesting time. I keep making new friends. I need to stop. But I can't. I can't stop. So I guess because there's a limited number of friends that will show up in your feed, but you can still have more than that. To be honest, I was probably going to end up doing it eventually. Oh. It's super cute. I'm glad you shared it in the Discord view because everybody should see your art. It's very cute. Hi, Tomato! More friends, yes. Always more friends. Actually, Apple was an orphan possum. Kilo had some experience with possums, so they knew how to handle Apple properly, but yeah, we didn't want it to die. Oh, I'm so glad that you took it in. Possums are really good for the environment, too. They're like very clean. They don't it, they don't contract rabies, I don't believe. And uh they they eat a lot of like pests, like ticks, like natural pests. So they're just like a natural pest control and yeah, they they do lots of good things. Okay, let's see. Uh let's go ahead I want to hang on to my 400 candles for just a little bit longer, so I want to go ahead and... Oh, somebody put on a trail spell. I'm going to match your trail spell with one of my own. Oh, look at this. I got six. It's a purple one. Let's do it. Okay. There we go. Okay, I need to get a winged light from here. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, we'll do mission stuff. Oh, you cannot see the trail very well here. But it's there. Trust me on this one. It's there. <laughs> that was a very dramatic fall. <laughs> that pose, though. Come here, kiddos. I'm going to call you kiddos, because I know you're all younger than me. <laughs> I want bloom cape and hair. I might not get the hair, though. I'll probably get the cape. I'm scared to see how much everything's going to cost. Ah, oh, did you put on a trail spell too, lifeblood? Did you get it? Okay. We're gonna go over here because we have to go to the sapling. Yes! We all have trail spells. I think the light is gonna be circling around and over here. So we can just grab it on the way back. And then there's this salute one, and I'm not sure. There's two different ones that that could be. That could be either the uh, seasonal one, which is not fun to relive, but doable. And then there's one, and then there's another one in the, I guess, the boat, the sunken ship. 
and that one is a little bit easier to relive in my opinion. Both of them have a, a dragon patrolling the area though. Oh, it's the Lady Dimitrescu spirit. <laughs> the one that looks like Lady Lady D. She's got like the same hat. She's very tall. Except uh she's cowering in fear. That's that's not very Lady D esque. I blow bubbles. I'm unlocking- oh wait, hang on. I'm unlocking the gold stuff I haven't already in Mario Kart 8 at the moment. It's going slow. Oh, nice. Mario Kart 8. Spooked him. <laughs> Good job, Life Flip. No, they, they give you hugs and then they disappear. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait for her to offer me a hug. She's gonna hug the tree first. Then she wants to hug me, maybe. That's so cute that they hug the tree. They keep adding like little things like this to the game just to give a little bit more flavor. There we go. Yay! It's like hugging grandma. It's kind of cheap not including the in-app purchases. The purple bloom keep is 105, the cherry blossom keep is 70, and the hair is 20 hearts. Not chunk enough for Lady D. Yet yeah, that's true. It's TD's having to race through all the Grand Prairie and collecting coins. Oh no! I guess grinding through it, does that make you better at it though? Oh, it's like a gradient. I like that. Pink into purple. So so reliving whatever this one's going to be is not going to be fun. But we'll do it. Let me make sure that you three all got it. Everybody get it? Nope. Lifeblood missed it. Oh, I can man's here. Hello. We're here. Do you need to do uh dailies, I can man? We've already done a couple of them, so we can redo them if you need if need be. They're pretty simple today. I lost the game. <laughs> Tomato, why? Hong Kong. I have the forest elder hair. No! <laughs> oh my gosh, Tomato. <laughs> uh, I feel like this is gonna be, like, there's gonna be an association now with it. With my stream and and that. That's a curse. Finished Kirby, but wow, it has a lot of post-game content. Oh, really? It hasn't even been out for very long, so you finished it already? <laughs> Tomato, you're such a little troll. Sadly, I have lost the game. <laughs> Here, I'm going to attempt to get you through this little light, just in case you haven't gotten it. You shouldn't join Pearly. Shouldn't have joined. You get cursed. You join, you get cursed. Okay, hopefully that counted. Man, my light is re- Selling very fast though, so that's good. Can be very reckless with my light. Playing bots is boring and bad and bots cheat. No, I don't. Doesn't make me better at the game. The tracks I'm bad enough to struggle against the bots can be won through big brain moments. Using my brain cells to launch myself across half the track into first place directly in front of the finish. Nice. Oh yeah, AI can be pretty unfair. Oh, look at this! Aww, we have the new cape. 
Oh, it's cute. Is this supposed to be like a flower? Like a... Um, maybe an orchid of some kind? That's what it looks like with the little yellow dot there. Being purple with the little yellow dot. It's pretty. I hope that the spirit is not in the next area, but... Oh, just a flower petal. Okay. Reminds me of an orchid. The bots cheat because they can't keep up with user skips. Oh. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about Mario Kart as much, but like in the Mario Party games, uh, those bots are pretty cheapo too, if you put them on harder difficulties. So I would believe it, that the Mario Kart would also have unfair bots. Wow, I'm actually gonna have more than 400 candles for 10 more minutes. Okay, so it's not this one, or else it'd be shiny. So Seven used the Weasel Mask star pin during his stream for today, and I was wearing the Forest Elder hair. Now I think I've become Walmart brand Seven. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's right, because Seven does have... Um, Seven also has that hair. I only have 40 candles now. <laughs> That's so tragic. Oh no. Oh wow, we got a lot of spells going. Oh right, you have to go to through the area. I'm sorry, Tomato. I completely forgot. Well, I will burn this. Oh, I was gonna say, while you're doing that, I'll burn this so you don't have to wait. But just equipment is completely decoupled from the stats. Oh. It's okay. Yeah, I... I it's very easy for me to forget. I remember this one. <laughs> like, Bowser shouldn't have a higher acceleration than me. Because of stat limits, but bots. Oh. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, that's lame. That's the one thing that kind of sucks about those kinds of games, like Mario Party or Mario Kart, it's just like, it's not as fun if you're not playing with somebody else. It's kind of hard to coordinate that with other people. Somebody else used a spell. You got this one, Tomato? Man, it's been a while since I've done Eden. I really just don't feel like doing Eden. <laughs> so I haven't done it in a, in a while. Oh, this purple cape is so cute! I hope this one isn't one of the ones that you have to buy, because it's not going to happen. But I would be very tempted to buy this one. You have to buy the tea set. Oh, okay. Yeah, that one I think has been super popular. Don't mind me, just trying to get to the shiny boys over here. There's one. And then we can go to the, the boat. Oh 
Oh my goodness, hello. <laughs> Draw origami games. Oh, hi. How does that work? Drawing origami? Or you, do you draw and do origami? I used to know how to make um, little, little tiny things like the um, the little fortune teller things from paper, as well as um, there was like a cube. I could I could make a cube. I thought it was so fun because you had to like fold it in a certain way and then there was like a hole at the bottom and you had to like blow into the hole and then it made a cube. Oh, we lost a we lost an IKEA man. IKEA man, come back. No, no, they're just gone. Maybe their internet died. I'm sure they'll be back. Thank you for the follow. That's just all my hobbies meshed together. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Bad. Bad news bears. Bad news. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Mint! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh no. That And that got tomato. And nobody else. That was just cruel. I'm sorry, tomato. Oh no, that did get me too. Nah, that's deserved. That's deserved. <laughs> it got me too. No! Bad. That was bad. That was a, I was reading the chat while in the wasteland and I shouldn't have done that. Sorry. That's definitely on me. That was an oopsie. Oof, <laughs> the Krillies gotcha. Yeah, that was my bad. Bots have leather banding to make the game more interesting. Oh. I think leather banding is the right term. I mean, you're probably right. I wouldn't know any better. Got lucky though and didn't lose anything. Okay, good. I think I lost like one. Did you lose anything, Tomato? I mean, you were just- we were just collecting shiny boys for you. So we gotta- we gotta make up for it and collect more shiny boys for you. Like on NYE, we were doing a high school friends get together and I was drunk and seeing triple. They're also good at playing video games and almost sober, but I still won. Wow. It's, a, it's up here somewhere. You know, that never- you know, I should never read chat in any Krill area, yeah. Fair point. I can't see where the shiny boy is. Where is it? I can't see it because I've already collected it. I think I have all of them. Oh, you don't know if you lost any. Okay. Here, let me let me collect my little candle before I try to attempt to find this again. Dang, Inky, that's impressive. I wouldn't want to play against you in anything. I think you would beat me in if I played against you in anything. They got they got rid of the shiny boy here. What? I play Sky on mobile, and I just bought the red cape today. Oh, nice. And it slightly sucked. Oh. How dare they? How dare they get rid of the shiny boy? I don't know, tomato has blue and I have purple and lifeblood is pink. We are we are the bi flag today, apparently. Our our trail. Makes the bi flag. Okay, we got pink. Pink, purple, and blue. <laughs> I love it. They're gonna put it back in the new update. Okay. 
I hope they do. I don't know why they would get rid of it. That's baffling to me. No. Bad crabs. Bad crabs. All I want to do is burn this plant. Let me do that in peace. Okay, there we go. Oops. Luckily I have lots of friends, so getting the hearts wasn't hard in the Sky Sora Discord server. Sky Sora. <laughs> Doesn't Sora mean sky in Japanese? So the Sky Sky server. I love that. That's wonderful. Hey, let me let me participate in this, please. I want to get this. Yeah, okay. I might be wrong about it. Wrong about way how. Oh, oh, about the the spirit or the shiny boy. Ah, oh, man. Okay, well, I prefer this reliving the spirit here than the other one. I'm glad it's this one. Uh, well, I don't know. They they already have so many shiny boys, so... I guess losing one isn't the end of the world. I'm sure there's, like, somewhere else. If, they're, if they don't put it back, I'm sure there's somewhere else that it's going to make up for losing it here. Ooh, camera's going all over the place because of the spirit. I'm just letting them relive it the rest of the way. It's fun when there's a challenge, but I only know one person who can keep up with me while drunk or sober. Luckily, I have lots of friends. Okay. On the internet, I met some better players. I'm not sure, but it's a big sky community. Aww. Yeah, I think they have, like, an official Discord. With a lot of, like, thousands of members in it. And they have, like, tons of resources and stuff on there, which is nice. I'm not sure if that's the same server as the one that you were in. Oh, they didn't finish it. Alright, I guess we'll have to finish it. Yeah, we got the rest of these, though. Oh no, they're here. They're just... okay. They're just frozen. It's fine. There we go. Maybe they were letting us get it. I decided to close out of the music screen. It decided to close me out of the music screen for some reason. Oh no! How rude! You better listen to Lifeblood play. Oh wait, Tomato was typing. Maybe, maybe they didn't get it. Let's try that again. Just in case. So do you... I guess since you guys bought the stuff already, my cousins and I are really competitive on Mario Kart on the DS and my family are are in any Mario Party. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I tried so hard to get my mom to play Mario Party with me the other day and she I'm so bad that game company decided to stop me from playing music. That's so rude. You need to listen to Lifeblood play, how dare you? You cannot he cannot be silenced. Honestly, I'm not even that great at Mario Kart. Oh. Yesterday I did Eden for the first time ever with a friend that knew all the secrets to get away from the krill. Aww! Awesome. That's so nice. I love being led around by somebody who knows more. Who knows what they're doing. Like, I feel like I'm in good hands.
I'm only mildly competent. I don't think you're downplaying yourself, Inky. Because Krill are evil. Krill are terrifying. We got hit today, but th that's okay. It's because I made an oopsie. It, and it was a very unfortunate spot to get spotted. Because when you're up in the middle of the air, there's there's nowhere that you can hide anymore, you know? You might be better than me, it all depends on your measuring yourself against. My friends might be scrubs. Well, here's the deal. I almost never play Mario Kart. I don't even know... There's like a, a strategy to... Um, to boost yourself using like drifting mechanics and like every time I play Mario Kart I I can't for the life of me figure out that mechanic and then when I finally start to like just get it down for the first time on a very rudimentary level um, then I stop playing it and then enough time passes between me playing that time and the next time that I forget I told you that you'll get hit by a crow. <laughs> Statistically speaking, it's bound to happen eventually. I'm decent at Mario Kart, I'd say. Nice lifeblood. Now I know that I'm not good at it, but that's just because I never play it. I got to level 58 Winged Light. Nice. So how long have you been playing for? You sound like a new player. Getting hit by Krill is like getting hit by a blue shell in <laughs> Mario Kart. Yeah, there's nothing you can do once they see you. Once they see you and if there's no hiding spot, that's it. Also, thank you about the trails. We have trail spells on right now. So I don't think we even meant to color coordinate it, but it looks like a gradient. That's really cool. Um, no, 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 there's like some kind of a mechanic where you can make yourself go faster if you drift. Um, and it'll like give you a boost. And people who aren't very good at Mario Kart, in my opinion, uh, or like, you know, who aren't experts at it, don't play competitively or anything, like, constantly are teaching me that, that mechanic the one time that I play with them, or they'll be using that, utilizing that mechanic, and I'll just be like, what? I'll just be completely lost. But I'll just get totally destroyed by them. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Lifeblood. I'll get totally destroyed by them. I can't even win against the bots. Oops. I could I could probably win against bots on easy in Mario Kart. Yellow, you don't know how to drift boost. Uh, no. <laughs> I'm I'm baby at Mario Kart because I never play it. I have the I have the first the original one. On the uh, Super Nintendo, I played that one. There, there was no such thing as a as a drift boost in that one, I don't think. And then I played it on the uh, N sixty four. So, uh, really showing my age. It's basically the longer you drift, the more of a boost you get. Yeah, there's there's like a way to finagle it. Uh, but I kept messing it up. I don't know what I did wrong, but I kept doing something wrong. Uh oh, we got a we got a bot. <laughs> I, don't, I honestly, I mean, I'm gonna ban them. Hang on. Second, let me ban this person. You know, it's funny though, because I have like some kind of um, I want to become famous, right? <laughs> no, I have some kind of a um, a thing, you know, where it's like, oh, you know, you can ban specific words or phrases 
So I have want to become famous um, band, but apparently it doesn't matter to the bots. Somehow they're able to surpass that. Even when I had like link sharing turned off and all that, it was like those bots still somehow got around it, so... I don't know. Blue shell ain't that scary. There's tons of ways to avoid blue shell. Oh! Okay. Well, to a newbie like me, there is no way. <laughs> as far as I know, there's no way. I think I've been playing for one to two years now. I remember I got the game because every social media site I went to saw the Sky ad, so I figured it was a sign that I should try the game. After a while, I got hooked to it. How? Oh well, I'm glad. I'm glad you're here. And it is very addicting, I agree. It's so easy to get addicted to, the, to this game. How TF? I don't know, Inky. Ooh, big candles should be in the vault today. Oh, wait, no. We should we should do the the event stuff. We should do days of bloom event. I have to leave. See ya. Okay, tomato. Bye bye. We should do the days of bloom stuff, and then we can do the vault. Oh, we got almost five candles from the, the wasteland. Cool, cool. I'll let Lifeblood finish talking first. I like this. I feel like um, a lady knight with, with my sword pants. This game is basically, oh wow, I'm having so much fun, blinks, and now I'm stuck in the floor. <laughs> yep, that's, that's so true. Especially if you're small. If you're TV, that's it. My first semi-regularly played Mario Kart is Double Dash. I played N64 Mario Kart before then, but only once or twice, because you're a- Oh, okay. But I remember also actively avoiding Golden Wasteland, because the first time I saw Krill, I was like, what is that? <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's go home. <laughs> Aw, the crab. Oh yeah, I, I was definitely- same page as you. Um, after I got addicted to Sky, I was like, let's not do the Golden Wasteland. Let's do the Golden Wasteland as little as we possibly can do. Because the Krill were scary. And then at the time that I was playing, um, they had a lot of glitches to exploit to make it so you would be safe from dragons. And uh, those, oh, oops, those glitches no longer exist. Most of them, a couple of them still do. Oh, is this where it is? That's nice, it's right here. Okay, lifeblood is showing me. Thanks, lifeblood. Wow, you actually had to look for that. Ah, okay, so I get these for free. I already have- well, I actually- yeah, I have those ones already. I'm not gonna take the ones I already have. I don't need those. Hi, you! Oh. <laughs> Bye, you! <laughs> oh, there you are. Okay, you're coming over here. I see. Wait a second. Yeah, I'm not buying that. But... She gives free stuff- oh, right here. Do we? Yeah, I already have those. Oh! Okay, so I have to spend way less than I initially thought. Because I already have both of these. Yeah, because I bought those last year. 
Oh, I only have to spend a hundred candles. Okay, that's... Okay, that's not too bad. That's only a little bit more than I got back from the end of the season. Oh, but look at that. Oh, we fell below the 300 mark again. <laughs> Pain. Pain, but not as painful as I, as I anticipated. Cool. <gasps> oh, yay! So I have this cape now? Just forever? Yes. Oh, I do! I can just put it on. Yay! I like this cape. I'm gonna I'm gonna hang on to it for a bit. They didn't fix the cause of the glitch, they only fixed some of the things that incidentally triggered it. Oh streamer says only a hundred. <laughs> Me with like a hundred candles. <laughs> oh, you haven't seen the half of it. If you think I have a lot of candles, you should see um Mr. Seven. Mr. Seven has an insane amount of candles. Or, um, Prince Alarming. He's got, like, over a thousand. Um. Alright. Well, that's all I really wanted to do here. You want to go back home and then do the vault, Lifeblood? Gonna scream so you know. Thanks. Thanks, bud. Candle mania. <laughs> I don't even know how you get that much. Oh, it, grinding. Just grinding. A little bit every day. Well, this, this in between seasons time is nice too, because normally I just try to get 10 candles a day. But I can do 10 candles a day plus 4 extra. Because of the, uh, the missions are now not seasonal candles. Um, and then the area after the... So every day there's going to be daily missions in certain areas, and that'll get you four candles. And then in the following, like the area, um, the little portal next to the daily missions area. There will be candles in front of that one. You're gonna get next season's... Um, you know, I don't know. The seasonal pass? I'm not sure. I'm actually not sure. I was so charmed by this season. Ooh! We can open the door. I was so charmed by this season, and I've seen some stuff in regards to the next season, but it's... I don't think anything has particularly gripped me uh, like this past season. So I might- I actually might skip this next season. 550 coins until the last unlock. It's gonna take an hour or something. Oh, you're close though! That's a lot of dedication. Oh no! <laughs> Did they seriously warp out? That's so mean! It was two people right there! <laughs> That's all we needed was the two people! Oh, yeah, I feel that. <laughs> I feel that lifeblood. Oh. <laughs> it's okay. We can- we can skip this area. Or we can just sit here and scream until somebody shows up. Oh, Red is on. Red! Come here, Red! <laughs> Plus I'm pretty casual of a player. Oh, okay. Considering that you can only get 10 coins per race at most. Oh, no. Yeah, that'll- yeah, that'll take a while for sure. Yeah, I'm- I, I'm in this weird in between because I'm not. I'm definitely not a casual player because I'm. I'm a lot more. Um, I'm a lot more dedicated. Like I'll play very faithfully almost every day, if not every day. 
Um, especially during a season. If it's between seasons, like right now, I might skip a couple days. <laughs> oh, there's someone. Oh, there's oh, two people that glitched upwards. <laughs> Bye. Alright. That's okay. We can we can see if somebody else spawns. Uh, but yeah, so I'm not a casual player, but I'm also not like a crazy vet that has like a thousand candles and like a thousand hearts and knows like every out of bounds glitch and how to exploit it and knows exactly what events are happening when. I could come, but I don't know if the servers would match up to help you. Oh, <laughs> it's okay. No worries. If you ever do want to join us, though, you're welcome to. When we uh, when we finish the vault, I can add you as a friend if you want. I'm doing this unlocking now because I don't know how the DLC cups affects the unlocks. Oh, right, there's DLC coming out. Right. Okay, that makes sense as to why you're playing. Yeah, people were really hyped about that DLC. And I was I was happy for them, but at the same time I was like, I don't have that game, so can't relate. Okay, we're gonna have another moment here, aren't we? Where we don't have enough people. But you know what? I can I can circumvent this one. If this spell still works, I hope. Or this glitch. The one glitch that I, <laughs> that I can exploit. <laughs> and that I do exploit. I didn't feel like paying for DLC for a game I don't even play that often. Yeah. That's fair. Nope, 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 no! <laughs> I went through the floor! Okay, we'll try that again. It usually takes me a couple tries to get it. Excuse the, the jumpiness. And the bugginess. There we go. Ah, dang. No, we're, we're gonna glitch through here one way or another. It's a funny thing that you can still get the DLC levels in online matchmaking. Oh, really? Cool. So you don't necessarily need it. I think I'm crashing into the wall and then that's launching me just a little bit upwards. So I need to not put myself against the wall here. Ah. I'm doing this unlocking now. Oh, right. Some parts you had to win all cups on a specific speed, like 150cc win cups with two or more stars. I'm doing this before buying the DLC tomorrow. It's already out. Oh, okay. Oh, Rad is here. Hi, <laughs> Rad. Oh, well, then we only need one more person. Oh. I think he... Went to the next area. Red! <laughs> Come back, Red! Hi, Red! <laughs> oh no! We lost him. I'm sure he'll be back. Hmm. 
No, yeah. That's unfortunate when you load into the wrong place. Okay, so doing that didn't help. I actually do have to switch to the... Yeah, they're trying to do this too. <laughs> See, this is why I don't boast that I know how to do glitches, because even when I do know how to do them, I can still mess them up pretty, pretty poorly. Oops. Oh, now it's not working at all. There we go. I see that candle. It's all lit up. That big candle. Red! We're over here! We are just... Okay. There we go. We got it. We got it. We're good. <laughs> it's all good. Uh oh, life blood. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can warp to me. Alright. Well. We did it. And we somehow lost <laughs> Rad a second time. <laughs> oh no, Rad. Bruh. Yeah, this is. This is. This is happening. Oh, we can help the... Now we server split, right? Oh yeah, that that's my luck a lot of the time, too. I haven't updated Mario Kart since before the DLCs came out to avoid the possible unlock changes. So yeah, I'm essentially playing offline. Oh wow. What a time to server split. Okay, well if we... Maybe Rad can can warp to us now, since we're all going the same way. He doesn't have to spawn in the meditation circle. I'm a floor goblin, yes. Everyone else is tiny. It's like we're we're preemptively doing Chibi Mask Wednesday. <laughs> I just went to the vault and no one was there. But I'll add you after, sure. Awesome. I live in the floors. <laughs> Oh, how did you like the uh, Kirby game, Lifeblood? I started to see some, um, very little, but I saw a little bit of gameplay for it. It looked very cute. The DLC update affects the gold. Wait, the gold glider unlock and resets it back to ten thousand coins instead of five thousand. I would just take. Uh, yeah, I guess it would be good to be cautious, just in case something like that happens. Definitely would not want something like that to reset. That's kind of how I felt about, like, uh, Pokemon Sword and Shield. They had those DLC things that, uh, basically, they added a whole bunch of other Pokemon and stuff. So it would take, I guess if you had those DLCs, it would take so much more to finish the Pokedex. 
Very good, very hard. Not to screenshot more cute as heck things. Oh. <laughs> We're already almost back to 300 candles. Yay! I only lost a little bit of candles. We're we're breaking even. We're maintaining. I'm I'm very happy for myself. <laughs> I love that for me. Kirby always seems like a very delightful, adorable type game. But this was like the first... this was the first 3D one? If I remember correctly. So was it like... was it super different? Having a 3D one? It's also one of the games where I actually tried to get 100% completion. Aww. I joined the Discord so I can give you the QR after. Aww! Thank you! Draw Origami Games. What would you like your name to be when I add you? Is Draw Origami Games good, or would you like a different name? There was a small spin-off title that was 3D. Oh, okay. That was it. Okay. So technically not the first 3D. I see, I see. Wait, which one was it? Which one was the 3D one? I don't know enough about Kirby. I've only played a couple of the games. So you could tell me just about anything and I would believe it. No problem. It can be draw or draw origami is good. Oh, okay. Awesome. Oops. Let's get... Yay, I'm tall again. <laughs> That's such a short spell. It's only ten minutes. Oh, I like this cape. I think the spinoff is called Kirby's Blowout Blast or something. Okay. Not one that I've heard of. I've only played a couple. I have, um, I play have some on like the Game Boy, Game Boy and Game Boy Advance Kirby games, and I think there are some on the um, Super Nintendo and Nintendo Online Pack. <laughs> They're adorable. Thank you, random stranger. Yeah, once you've done Eden enough times, draw origami, um, you'll be able to level up even further because you'll start the game with more winged light. So you're at 58 now, but you'll definitely get even more. But you have to do Eden like pretty frequently. There was a short amount of time when I was doing Eden, like once a week. Way before I started streaming. 
but doing Eden that often makes it very tiring <laughs> to to go back and do it again. So you don't you don't have to be that crazy to do it that often. When I when I dedicate myself to something a little too much, I, I end up just saying like, yeah, I'm a little crazy, but I do this. <laughs> Like, I have a Duolingo streak that's insane. It's like 2,000... over 2,500 days in a row. I think that's a little insane. Yay! We did the things. We did the things! What else could we do? We could just do more candle collecting if you want. Because I still want to get my 10 candles. But ooh. Sunset. I like that you have the one flower petal cape and then I have the other one. I thought you were gonna friend origami. Oh yeah, they they added me on Discord. Let's see. Let me open my Discord. Where are ya? Where is my Discord? <laughs> there it is. Oh, okay. No, there's nothing in there right now. But we can do it now. If you're free. Oh yay, Rad is here. Hi, Rad. I'm so sorry that you had so much trouble finding us. In the vault. But yeah, draw origami if you're still here. Game was too buggy to meet in vault. Oh, I see. Yeah, I think it was just forcing you to meditate and go to the next floor. Yes, it is a stream. Pretty much every time I stream during- or every time I'm playing during the week, it's not at a crazy time at night, then yes. Red World says hi. Hi chat. Oh, Tomato's back. I'm not in stream yet. Oh, that's okay. No worries. <laughs> Let's dance. We'll dance to the song this time. It's been a while since we've danced to it. <laughs> Hello, people. Oh, that was good timing. <laughs> we made that work out pretty well, actually. Hi, Sam. We're chillin'. We're chillin' like villains. Chillin' like villains. <laughs> well, we still got a little bit of, of uh, trail spell left. Or I do. Now, I think draw origami is, isn't free right now. But if they want to add us later... I'm I'm fine with whenever. Whenever's best for them. We got a sim, we got a 
lifeblood, we got a rad, we got a oh, tomato. No, we don't. We lost a tomato. Hi, Sam. Oh, there's tomato. Hi, Sam. Oh. Oh, thank you. Oh, do you need do you need um hearts? Okay. I got you. Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> What's with that face, tomato? Blessed. I was flying. Sorry, I, I beeped and I didn't see your name, so I assumed that you were no longer in the area. You said I was gone. Because <laughs> normally if I beep, even if you're off screen, I can still see your names pop up. And your name did not pop up. <laughs> That's fair. You know what? That's fair. Gonna go AFK for a second. Okay, okay, lifeblood. Go ahead. <laughs> the sass today. The tomato's so sassy. 470 coin. Oh my god, Inky. That's a long ways to go. So you've done three races? Hi, Sim. Didn't do dailies, since you don't get seasonal candles. Oh yeah. D now is the time to slack off, for sure. I'm always sassy. That's true. That is true. You have shown it time, time and time again. In stream. <laughs> And even in the Discord server. A sassy ducky. When am I not sassy, right? I started driving donuts and hearts in order to spice stuff up. <laughs> I've done eight races. No! Oh, God. You yeah. No, you're you're gonna be there a while, Inky. Sassy Duck Mato. Do do we need to add on to your name? Do do we need to add the uh, the sass title? Maybe I'll make a sassy roll <laughs> and give it to you. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> So what's the difference between these two? Hang on. Okay, sparkly. Oh, extra sparkly. Okay, I see. Only 47 races to go? <laughs> Only 47. Ooh, Sim! What are you gonna play for us? Do I have the... hang on. Yes, I do. Okay, good. Musical instruments was turned up the most, yes. That's what I like to see. I'm gonna try a song, okay! Oop, my controller ran out of battery. Time to take a break. Oh, there you go. Yeah, I, I think taking a break would be a good idea. Be right back. Okay. We are ready to listen to your song, Sim. <laughs> D 
did you get all of the uh, Days of Bloom stuff read? I love how uh, the portal above the forest is decorated now. Was that from? That was pretty soon. Ah! <laughs> it's a bit too fast. I don't know what it is. It sounded great to me. Question for the people who do I have returned with dinner. Good. What's for dinner? I was gonna say I have a question for the people who do music stuff in, in this game and play instruments. Yummy. And wrong instrument. Oh no. How do you learn new songs? Do you do you teach yourself or do you look it up or does somebody else teach you? Oh, Yoka's here. Sweet potato. Beef, rice, and gravy with mushrooms. Ooh. Beef and potatoes. And rice and gravy. That sounds delicious. I use YouTube. That was great, Sim. It was! I use YouTube and watch what the notes are. Oh, cool. Hi, Yoka! Oh, look how cute and purple you are! Purple and pink! Hang on. No. <laughs> I gotta hug Yoka! <laughs> Let me hug Yoka! There we go. Yay! We're matching! Like my set, yes. It's so cute. It's it's cute and fluffy. It, you have the little like, yeah, you have the little fluff around the neck, and the and the cute flowery hair and the bow. What song is that, Sim? I mean, I think it would be kind of like playing a MIDI piano or MIDI pad. So like prep work and stuff. Yeah, that, no, I think there are like apps that will let you set it up like that. Where you can play with MIDI stuff. Originally had those pants for extra fluff. Yeah, it does look fluffy. Did everybody have a what's better, juggler pants or greeter pants? Oh, those are both pretty fluffy. Um, 
Um, I like the ones that you have on now, though. Hi, Rob! Oh my goodness, we have so many people here now. Hi, everybody! Good to see you. Yeah, I like the ones that you have on now. I think they're cute and fluffy. I would say juggler pants. Uh, my vote is with juggler pants. I don't know which is which. Papa Tomato is here. Oh! Okay, I went too hard. Oh no! That was good, Sim. I like it. I think the greeter pants are more puffy. Oh, okay. Well, then I'm wrong. Those are juggler. Juggler pants are more puffy. Juggler look more puffy, but greeter look more fluffy. You have a little bit more fuzz on the greeter pants. Sorry for interrupting. No, you're good. You're good, Rob. You're not interrupting anything. We're just hanging out. Don't worry about it. Oh, I know what that is. That's Howl's Moving Castle. If I ever start playing, I'm going to use my MIDI piano as my primary input method for Sky. Forget controllers. Embrace instruments. <laughs> I wish. I don't actually have anything that could do that. Juggler's favorite. Juggler looks nice. I like it. Yes! I've been learning that on the ukulele lately. I was trying to play Isabella's Lullaby from Promise Neverland. Okay, I haven't seen it. That's why I haven't. Uh, busy Night Sky, it is. That's why I didn't recognize it. But it was very pretty. That's hard. Yeah, it is hard. It's been fun learning it on the ukulele, though. Yes, happy bloomness. Oh, <laughs> look at you with that emoji. I love that emote. It's so cute. Very, very cute. Merry go round of life is such a beautiful culture, right? Console tuner goes brr. <laughs> Aw, Inky, you do music stuff? I want to hear. I want to hear everybody's music skills. Show me. Show me the music. That's like the only... Um, that's really the only song in Hell's Moon Castle 2 that's like memorable is Merry Go Round of Life, but it's such a good song. I wish Peking Postman would reveal tomorrow. Are you manifesting? <laughs> Are you manifesting Peking Postman reveal? <laughs> I'll I'll join you in that. Oh, everybody's playing now. Tomato Sim and Rat's friend. Hi, Joy Joy Bells. No music for heathen ears. What? <laughs> Only my ears are allowed to bleed from my music. No, I want to hear. <laughs> Hi, Joy Joy Bells. How are you? I play music here and there, but I'm not that great compared to others. I want bunny mask so bad. I will I will join you in manifesting that energy, Yoka. I screw up a lot. Aww. Yeah, I have, um, I have stage fright. Like, I can't. I can't uh, perform music in front of other people. I can't do it. Also, I need dark pants too. Yes! Oh, those are the best! I love those pants so much. Yeah, so I can't I can't play stuff in front of people, but um, I love it. I love music stuff all the same. Postman's Beard is my favorite. Yes. Same. I love the cackling cannoneer, but Postman is still adorable. 
I also want that bunny mask. Oh. Y'all new er players. Oh man, I was just playing this. I love this game. Wait, you were playing Sky? Or you were playing um, the instruments? Instruments in Sky. <laughs> Tomato is like, be jealous. I have the mask. Postman has the perfect pants for red and dark capes. Yes. That's all I wore for the longest time, was just black and red outfits. <laughs> Tomato showing off. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, I left a thingy. I left, um... Yeah, I, I left a message for, like, the first time ever. Oh. <laughs> Thanks. I realized I had all those, all these little paper boat spells and I never used any of them. Choo choo, I'm just about to go to sleep. Aww. Good night, Red. I just finished doing the dailies. Oh, yep, I was playing Sky. Gotcha. Aww. The dailies were pretty easy today. I'm glad. <laughs> You're showing off the pants, too. Oh my gosh, tomato. <laughs> The sass today is unbelievable. Same on stage fright when it comes to instruments. Oh, I feel that. Being a choir person for a while didn't cure me from my musical stage fright. Oh no! Did you know that the cape resembles the journey scarf? Oh yeah! It does! You're right! I just played journey the other day. I mean, I, I played it for the first time a very long time ago, but I replayed it for the first time in a long time the other day. Song too fast. Oh, that's okay, Sim. I don't know why, but finding spirit today was hard for me. Oh, have a good train ride. Thanks, Red. No, I, if you don't already know where it is, then it's going to be harder to find. It's definitely off, to, kind of off to the side. The spirit today in that, like, secret... I mean, not super secret, but still kind of secret area in the wasteland, so that's understandable. I'm glad you found it eventually, though. Oh, man, Inky. I feel that so hard, though. Um, I was never in choir. I was never a choir person. But, um... Oh, my princess set got updated. Ooh, let's see it, Yoka! I wanna see. Uh, but I did do some piano stuff. <sighs> when I was in college, I did a piano class. Uh-oh. We lost them. I did a I did a piano class in college. Well, let me preface this by saying I did orchestra growing up, and then I switched to band. And also I took piano lessons, like, separately. Uh, so I, I have, like, a musical background. Oh, Yoka, it's so pretty! With the, with the flower petal cape. Yes! It's so pretty! Um, but then when I was in college, for fun, I joined a music class. It was like a piano class. And it was basically, like, you teach yourself how to play piano, but everybody in there was somebody who had never touched a piano except for me. So the, the teacher just let me do whatever I wanted because I already knew how to play. So it was kind of a waste of time for me. It wasn't really a class, it was just a, okay, we're going to have 30 minutes where I just dink around on the piano. Uh, but she liked my playing, and then she was like, oh, you should do this concert and like perform. And I was like, okay. And I picked a song that I was going to perform. And I practiced it, and I practiced it for hours every day, and I could could never get it down perfectly. And so when it came the day that I was supposed to perform, like, I still played it, but I messed up a lot, and it was horrifying, and yeah, it was a bad experience. 
I looked away from the Sky News website for a few days and it ends up suddenly dropping a bunch of news on me. Oh no! <laughs> look, Twitch chat. Oh, look at Twitch chat. Okay. Look closely at my mask. The design is my tiara. Oh! Yes! That's so pretty! Oh, Yoka! I love that. Yoka, you're gonna have so many OCs. <laughs> so many Sky OCs. I love that everyone's attached to me, so everybody claps because I'm clapping. Alright, I finally got to the stream. Hi, Rat! Welcome! Chibi is so short, tell people are looming over them. Yeah. Just found about found out about the Wind Path realm today. Oh, You're finding new stuff every day. Only reason I call Princess. Oh, because it's a tiara. Gotcha. Love it. Where's Naughty Emote? There it is. Hi, Red! Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the stream. How was your weekend? I had a good costume idea for the bunny mask, but the problem is I actually need it. <laughs> well, we'll manifest it. We'll manifest the the bunny mask coming in today. Or not today, but this week. With the next traveling spirit. We'll manifest it. And hopefully we'll make it happen. I was gonna maybe try to collect the ten candles, but mm. just here for showcasing my set. Gotcha, Yoka. Okay, we'll hang out here. Now I'm chilling. Nice. Very busy. <laughs> oh, it was a busy weekend. What'd you do? Oh, hi, Hannah Banana Rama. I hope you're well. Thank you. I'm doing fine. I hope you are too. Going to play Ezio Collection. Oh, okay! Aw, oh, have fun! Kinda hope it isn't the next Traveling Spirit, because I just spent all my candles on bloom. Oh, good point. Yeah, I didn't think about that. Because I have enough still to afford the next stuff. Oh. Just lots of outdoor stuff. Enjoying the spring. Aww. Spring cleaning? Are you still doing your, your weekly run? Would have liked more music theory in music class. Aww. Kinda same, Inky. Um. I learned... I learned music in a lot of different ways because I took a lot of different classes for it growing up, but I didn't actually routine that much. It's kind of sad. I'm good. I have over a thousand candles. Yoka, how? No, it's Yoka's time. It's Yoka's turn to show off. 1,194 candles. <laughs> Me too, Tomato. I have a thousand less than Yoka. <laughs> I have a little less than a thousand less than Yoka. <laughs> I wish it was spring where I live. I s still, tons of snow where I live. Oh, where do you live, Drawer Gummy? We did a lot of miles on Saturday, and then we went to Stratford today, so there was more. I thought I saw a, um, a notification about you streaming, like, today, but, like, super early in the morning for me. So obviously, I wasn't awake when it happened. I just saw the notification after. I have a thousand, a hundred less than Yoka. <laughs> Granny made 20 candles a lot easier. I see. So you were getting 20 a day for a while. Yeah, that's like twice as much. 
twice as much grinding as I do a day. <laughs> oh, no, Canada. Oh, okay. Oh, tomato. You have another Canadian here. Yeah, it would be too early for you. I've joined a couple of your streams where you want, where you do your runs. But yeah, it's always super late and I'm like about to go to bed. It's currently autumn where I live. Loving it. Oh, Do you live in the, the southern hemisphere, Joy Joy Bells? What do I care for when Bach died for that he was good with pipe organs without any explanation for why it's relevant? Oh, yeah. Yeah, good point, Inky. I was thinking about getting into music so I could be a jack of all trades when it comes to game dev, but then I decided I shouldn't because that would probably burn me out. I do three or four realms thanks to Granny. Wow. Yay, another Canadian. <laughs> Besides Thunder, yep. Oh, well, I don't know. My thing with music is that I know some people are really good. She deserves all the hugs. She does. I love Grandma. Um, I know some people are really good at art and like they specialize at art and they have like the patience to also put in a whole bunch of time to like hone their art skills and like I'm not that person I, I don't like art enough to put in the effort and the time so like I'm not an artist gotta go see you again okay bye Yoka it was good to see you thanks for showing your stuff to us it's very pretty speaking of game dev I'm going to be joining a game jam soon oh you gotta show us what you come up with lifeblood Besides Finlay. Oh yeah, Finlay. I forgot I forgot Finlay was also um Canadian. Oh, Aizen's here too. Oh my gosh. We're just like going through shifts of people. I get people who wake up in the night sometimes. Aw. That's nice. Yep, I do. That's cool. That's gotta be that's very interesting to me. Okay, you're not trying to high-five me. I don't know who you're trying to high-five. Maybe it's lifeblood. Oh, worm is on. Oh my god. Yeah, it's, we're just cycling through friends here. <laughs> I'm just seeing friends spawn in the menu and then leave, and then new friends spawn in the menu. <laughs> in the home menu. That is, if I don't cripple under the pressure of stage fright. Oh, lifeblood. It's okay. Lovi? <laughs> Hi, Lovi. <laughs> I think Lovi was the new friend, a new friend that I made off screen. This guy's so busy did I know, right? Hi Lovi. Hi friends. Oh no, Lovi's one of Brad's friends, okay. Lovi's not somebody that I friended off screen. Hi hi. Oh, too many people to keep track of, I'm so sorry. <laughs> How are they? We're doing good. By the way, I love the purple cape. Me too! Good taste, Yoka. Good taste. Bye, Yoka! Uh, but yeah, with music stuff, like, I, I always had an interest in music. And I always had, I had the patience to actually put the time and effort into doing music stuff. So, um, so I definitely, I mean, I'm not trying to toot my own horn or anything, but I definitely know more than the average person just about music stuff just because I did so many classes and, and I practiced it enough and, and what have you. But like, I'm by no means an expert. There's like a certain level that like even indie artists are at that I'm not at. Um, and stage fright, you know, doesn't help with that. I find music theory interesting and instruments are fun, but I mainly play for the theory. What I do care for... History... But what I do care for freaking history... That's just important. Rich people who influenced music did this, but the specific thing in particular didn't influence music in any way. Ah, uh, okay. 
Yeah, a lot of... Well, I thought it was interesting uh, reading up on the history of it, too. Like, um, in a similar vein to art history, you know, there's there's music history and, and music went through phases. Like, there was a romantic period. There was a... Um, whatchamacallit? A Baroque period. There was a romantic romantic period, there was a classical period. I'm going to do Winged Light. Okay. I'll see you, Tomato. Oh, in the Wasteland. Gotcha. Oh, we can do a couple more candles, if y'all want to. I'm just gonna go get a couple more. Probably in the prairie, because it's easier. Uh, so I thought learning about the different- oops, we lost Lovi. That was fast. <laughs> I thought learning about the different periods was interesting. Um, and then some of the people, I, I liked learning about them as well. Oh, thanks. Oops. Lovi, do you have a bad connection? Okay. No, no, you're back. Oh, Rad's back, too. And I don't remember too much about about the specific people or anything, either. But... Uh, some other stories were interesting to me. All the same. <laughs> Lovi, you <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> oh, I gotta change Finley's name to Finley now. Sorry, my avatar is revealed. So it certainly is. <laughs> Music history can be fascinating on where it intersects with theory, but why would I want to know about dead German guys who managed to grandstand their ordinary achievements into legendary pieces? Yeah, if it was like, if it was just about like rich people tooting their own horns, it'd be one thing, but like, I wanted to get into piano or violin a little while back, but I remembered that those cost a lot of money. Oh yeah. I think it's worth it to get a piano though. Violin is very hard to learn. Um, piano is a little bit easier to learn basic stuff on. Uh, but violin is... is it, it's going to take a really long time before you can make it sound good. I'm saying that as somebody who learned the viol both violin and piano. Apparently if we go that far today, we're at the same level of the spirit. Lovi, what? <laughs> Honey, what? <laughs> No, 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 like, um, I'm just remembering very Monday. It is. What was it? It was Sh Schubert. Schubert was one of the composers that I learned about, and then he had, like, a weird situation where, like, his best friend was in love with his wife or something, and, and Schubert was, like, a very, like, quiet a uh, polite kind of guy and but he like really loved his wife and his best friend like a lot and he was bas he got sick at one point and he was like hey um you know i i want to entrust my family to you if something happens to me and it's like it was like listening to a drama story than more than it was learning about the music aspect of it. <laughs> Maybe that's why I thought it was interesting. And no, and then he died, and then his friend was like, like, stayed true to his promise for like all those years, and still like, even though he was in love with the wife, he never like tried to pursue her or anything. He just like respected his friend's wishes and looked after her until she passed away or until he passed away. 
or like Tchaikovsky had a lot of um, he had a lot of problems because there was like I guess a homophobia problem when he was around and so he was trying really hard to pretend to be straight and he like married a wife and but he couldn't like make it work with her and he attempted suicide like it was really sad Franz Schubert yeah I think it was Schubert it was either Schubert was either the one with the wife or he had or he was the best friend. I can't remember. But yeah, Bach managed to play the pipe organ perfectly the first time he tried. But you know, his dad was a music teacher and his brother, pipe organist in a church, taught him how to play beforehand. Oh, yeah. If you, if you know stuff like that, more of the background, then it becomes a lot less impressive for sure. Franz Schubert never married. Okay, so then it was... Then maybe he was the friend. I'm in your direct. My direct? <laughs> oh, thank you for following, Lovi. There you are. I remember your username now. Lovi's art. No, I don't, and I don't even really remember that much. I just remember bits and pieces like that. Also, I liked the, um, you know how art had its period of, of fighting against the organized style of things? Like, um, there was a period where, you know, an artist just basically submitted a blank canvas and like that's considered you know amazing art so there's a music equivalent of that as well there's a, a song called uh, 4 minutes and 33 seconds I believe and it's just a guy the musician goes sits at a piano for 4 minutes and 33 seconds and then does nothing He had a crush on one of his students. Oh, gross. <laughs> I don't remember learning about that. Yeah, I know that. Yeah, I just think it's fun. It's, it has less to do with what you were saying. Like, you, you're you saying that, like, oh, yeah, why is this important? Which I agree, it would be good to know that. But I guess just certain things are more interesting just because. Like, stuff like that. Or uh, there was another phase, and I don't remember what it was called. But they were trying to, again, rebel against the traditional, like, classical music. And um, and create music that did not have, like, that did not follow any kind of rules. Because classical music was all about following a pattern and, um, like, symmetry was part of it, too. So if you had something that, like, if you had a, a bar where, like, the notes were going up then in the next one it needed to go back down you know like it was very balanced and had a particular set of rules to it um but yeah so then there was another phase let's go to the beach beach <laughs> you're so silly uh so so another point of rebelling was they tried to again make music that was just really had followed no rules, sounded very primitive, lots of beating on drums and stuff. And they showcased this music in like a um, in a theater and people were so upset by this type of music that they like started rioting. <laughs> oh, so funny.
Four minutes and 33 seconds had a few sequels. Oh dear. <laughs> well, it's not capitalism if you don't try to, if more than one person doesn't try to capitalize off of it, right? Now in Spanish. Vamos. <laughs> La playa. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for your input, Lovi. It's very appreciated. Blank canvas thing in art. It was not a commentary on art theory, but on bad wages. Ah, okay. It was called Take the Money and Run. Well, that's better. That's, that's more understandable. Good. Oh, Louie. I hope you haven't already been to this area, because this would just be a waste of time for y'all. If so. Take the money and run. What a good title. That's like... There's a uh, some artist out there that has like these incredible pieces, and all of them are, are named something very silly. I need a little more energy. Lolo. We're trying. We're trying to, to collect enough energy for everybody. Uh oh! Did I lose red? How'd that happen? Red! Come back! Nope. Red is gone. He's a goner. Artist took 80 grand and ran. And that was the art. <laughs> Alright. I respect that. Also, I wish that were me. the tea tables. No. I, I don't think I'm going to. I, I bought this cape. And I and the previous year I had already bought the other flower petal cape and the hairstyle. But the tea table I'm not going to do because it costs like $20. And I'm trying to save money right now. So that's that's not doable for me. Call me okay, hang on. Call me Panda or Panda. That's a really cute name. Oh. What's up? Could I join you? Sure. Thank you for following. 4 minutes and 33 seconds. Number 2 is also called 0 minutes and 0 seconds and 4.33. Number 3 is actually called 1 to the 3rd and plus treble clef. Wow. <laughs> Incredible. Yeah, no, we just, we just finished collecting candles over here, so... Yay! I got my 10. So I'm ready to go home. Here, let me type that two people here. Just in case. Just in case somebody's not in the stream. By flight shortcut. My foot's got the idea. Oh yeah, that's um 
Man, Yoka is so good at, at taking advantage of that shortcut. But yeah, there is one. There, there's a wind tunnel up there. <laughs> Yay, we did it! Are you on mobile or are you on the Switch? Call me Panda. I guess I'll just call you Panda. <laughs> Both of them have more rules. Oh my god. Well, if they're entertaining, then can't complain. Sandra, aw, Sandra's on. I haven't seen Sandra in a long time. Sandra is a, a friend's mom, a sky friend's mom. Pa donde? Where are we going? Um, I think we're actually gonna hang out here for a bit. We're gonna we're gonna friend somebody. Mobile. Okay, just call me Panda. Search them up if you dare. <laughs> Maybe I will. Maybe I will. Okay, well, we'll add you as a mobile player and we'll call you Panda. And we'll leave it... We'll, we'll leave the the code up for you so you can scan it. Say yeehaw! <laughs> yeehaw! Yeehaw! Is that Texan enough for you? Do I sound Texan enough for you? Do I sound Southern enough for you? How entertaining they are depends on the performer. Make sh better make sure there's a traveling spirit when you lose all those candles. <laughs> yeah. I um I still ha I actually have almost 300 left over. So I might be able to afford, if there's a traveling spirit that I don't have anything for, I can probably afford everything for it still, thankfully. Also, hi Arrowids! It's been a while since I've seen you. How are you? Number two requires the performer to do something, and one cubed requires a sophisticated sound system. Yeehaw! <laughs> Is that a bird with a cowboy hat? <laughs> That's amazing. Oh, let me confirm it first. There we go. Yeah, I think I had to confirm it first. So if now it should work for you. Sorry about that, Panda. So yeah, we'll we'll wait here for a sec. It's gonna be the umbrella traveling spirit, I know it. Oh no. You don't have that one yet? It's a bird with a cowboy hat. I love it. I love that the cowboy hat is pink, too. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Yeah, it tends to be it tends to be the one that you don't have that, you know, you're sweating over being able to afford it. Those are always the ones that that come Oh! <laughs> Hi, Tomato. Call me Panda or Panda. I wouldn't hope for that. I also have this one. Oh my gosh, that's so cute! Zoom in because QR does not allow it due to the size of the screen. Oh, okay. Here, hang on. Is that better? Is it still... Oh, I got it. Okay, cool, cool. Like, where are we going? And I didn't say anything. <laughs> it's a panda! Great, subscribe for a draw! <laughs> You, back. you want me to follow you back? <laughs> I will have to follow you back. <laughs> oh, 
Oh gosh. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Erwin, what did you do? Erwin, <laughs> what did you do? Okay. Hang on. How many hydrants? <laughs> I'm seeing four. That we raffle yellow. Did y'all do daily quests? We did. We, we did those at the very beginning, unfortunately. Hydrate or dehydrate. I see. Okay. Okay. Okay, t uh, lifeblood is going to be sweet and add you. And so is tomato. <laughs> Four hydrates. Okay, thank you, Inky. <laughs> yeah, we, we did do dailies. Um, dailies aren't that bad, though. If you want us to come with you to do the dailies this time, uh, I would be down. It's a good thing I just replaced the water in this. Hi, Uni. <laughs> I love the I love that hair. Yes. Hello. Yeah, it would be kind of nice to do dailies if you don't mind. Sure, we can help you with that. Yeah, we we can do the dailies a second time and. Oh, actually. Yeah, if we're gonna do dailies, then I gotta I gotta hug you. <laughs> so much love. Yay. Perfect. Yes. There we go. Save candles that Thursday. Yes, yes, that's right. Traveling spirit on Thursday. It's okay. I have enough, Loby. It's okay. Don't worry. This time, Mint, don't try going in the krill light, please. No, no, no. We'll we'll be good. Um, I think I was looking for. Oh no, no, no! I was going for the wing of light for you. I don't. <laughs> okay, I have a panda. And I have a tomato. Yes, please. We'll, we'll be careful, especially because we have a, a panda with us. I only have 59. Yes, you, you are a baby. We, we have to treat you very carefully. Let's hope there's nothing I want on this traveling spirit. Yeah, right? <laughs> Okay, can we have... Okay. Perfect. Oh, look at this. We have a whole gang. Let's go, gang. <laughs> Unlocked an emote. Oh, look at you! Cute! Most people don't take advantage of that. That reward system. Panda's a moth. Panda is a moth. Panda's a baby. Oh dear, we grouped up so nicely and now we're going to have to do it again. Rip trail. I know, we, we were so organized. <laughs> Alright. I'm no moth. I have a lack of cosmetics. I see. You're, you're, you've graduated from moth. Okay, yes, everybody's connected, everybody's connected, good. You, you've graduated from moth because you- oh, you no longer have the moth cosmetics. Bro, I eaten yesterday. Ruh row. Be right back. Okay! No worries, lifeblood. Oh, but does that mean Lovi can't connect to us? Oh, Uni should- okay. Okay. <laughs> We're good. You eaten for the first time yesterday. Right? Conga line. 
come and shake about a baby to that conga. I know you can't control yourself any longer. I love Gloria Estefan. Uh, Inky, what do you want me to say? That's Texan. Oh no. <laughs> Man, this level is super counterintuitive to uh, grouping up, isn't it? Oh no, Panda. For the fifth time. Oh, the fifth time! Okay. Hang on, hang on. No, I'm gonna fix this. Don't you worry. I'm getting sassed at. That's my job. I gotta let go of Tomato's hand so I can hold Panda's hand. Oh wait, no. Panda can hold your hand. Okay, we're good. You should have seen what I saw. <laughs> I am no ma. Fifth time! Yeah, that's that's no ma. And you, you have cosmetics. Okay, we got it. You guys were walking into each other. Oh, uh-oh. Maybe a little jank. A little jank on our end. Y'all redeems are whack. I have no specific request. I just want to hear the strongest... The strongest accent you can try. Why, hello there, Inky. How y'all doing tonight? I'm a mini boatswain. <laughs> Why, thank you. Okay, that's one for Panda. Mira... Mira lo que se avecina a la vuelta de la es esquina. Uh, look at something. I, I don't... I, I understand Mina. <laughs> oh no. I'm so sorry, Lobby. Lo siento, Lobby. <laughs> I butchered that. It's a music theme. Oh! Oh, shy little frog. I love that song. <laughs> Are you having fun, Lifeblood? Okay, and after this we have one spirit to relive. Uh, and it's in the area with the boat. But we can kind of skip over where the dragons are to get to it. So it shouldn't be too bad to get to, get to it. Oh, and we have no more seasonal candles either. Oh, sad. Calm down. It's Spanish is difficult, I understand. Done. Oh, thank you, Panda. I'm sorry, Lovi. I appreciate you joining us. You sure about that, Mint? Lovi! Also, y'all excited for a certain ultimate coming back? Wait, wait, Panda. Panda, Panda, elaborate on that. Ultimate coming back. There's ultimate gifts coming back? Ah, uh, oh, which ultimate? Oh, so cute. Yes, I love that song. You play on Switch? Yes! I'm playing on Switch right now. Wait, since you're the leader, make everyone connected. Do you do the juggle emote? <laughs> I could do that. That's a spoiler of a season. Oh, okay. Okay, if it's a spoiler, it's okay. You don't have to say. Oops, wrong one. This one. Oops. Nope. <laughs> Nobody else is doing it, just me. <laughs> Even though we're all attached to each other. But do y'all want to know? I do. I do want to know, actually. But um, if people don't want spoilers, look away. If you don't want spoilers, look away. 
I'm going to say it in Morse code so y'all can decode it if you want. <laughs> okay. That works. That's a very creative way of sharing it. <laughs> That would be funny. Boo. I know it didn't work. I don't know why it didn't work. It should have. Also, Luna's on. Here, let's try it again. There we go. <laughs> As the dragon is attacking this poor thing in the background. The manta. Boy. <laughs> That's how we do. That's that's how we do in the Golden Wasteland, apparently. No. Don't translate. <laughs> okay. I took a screen cap of it. Synchronized judgment, yes. Oh, the krill is very cute. It is. It's pretty, it is cute. It's cute when it's not attacking you. <laughs> is that applause for the juggling inky? Thank you. Cute. <laughs> I think you broke tomato with that one. We need a rainbow curl for Days of Bloom, right? Boy, it's not cute. <laughs> what about what about when Okay. What about when there was the anniversary of Sky, the second anniversary, and all the dragons had party hats on? Did did you think they were cute then? No. <laughs> that was a very fast no. <laughs> I thought it was cute when they all had party hats on. The crabs were cute with party hats. Okay. The equivalent in Spanish would be- Oh yes, tell us, Lovie. Teach us Spanish. Man, we're having a lot going on today. We're getting Spanish lessons and music lessons and music history lessons. Element T, do you speak a second language? I can translate the thing into for no spoilers. Ter ternura. For the dragon? Um, I've been doing Duolingo for Italian for a long time. Uh, but that's no guarantee that I'm going to understand what you, what you translate. What is it with you people <laughs> with things being cute? <laughs> that's my whole that's my whole shtick tomato. I like cute things. See, I don't know. Okay, the spirit is over here. What do you expect when playing a cute game? Yes. So I will find a way for it to be cute. Dragon, I mean, dragons attacking you are not cute, but they, they can, they can, they can be cool, and then there's some art of them that's cute. Preciosura. Pelo di gufo. <laughs> really? <laughs> You're having fun saying boy today, aren't you, tomato? Yeah, no, that, that that didn't help me. Oh, how sad. I've been doing Italian for so long and I still don't know it. Nope. We're, we're not taking chances with the dragon. Horrifying death shrimp are always cute. <laughs> yes, I am king. 
I'm gonna go now. Bye. Oh, bye, Inky. Good night. Have a good night. Is it possible to juke krills when they're charging at you? Um. Uh oh, tomato got disconnected from us. Tomato. Okay. Mint. Yes, tomato. Imagine chibi krill. They would be cute. Um. So. With dragons, there I will say there used to be. There used to be um, glitches that would prevent you from getting hurt. I meant to say mint, not cave. <laughs> I love that. That's a mistake that you often make. Amigo, dónde vas? Where did your friend go? I don't. Um, which one? I don't know. Blurst sushi. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. <laughs> blurst sushi. Why is it blurst? How is it blurst? I I need to know these things. Imagine if they give the king krill a party hat during the anniversary event. That would be. I I would be a fan of that. I would love that. I mean, when you compare regular krills to Papa krill, they do look like chibi. They do. You know, in the Discord, they have these uh, emojis with the krill, and it's like krill with uh, like bridles on, and like the Sky Kids riding them. Those are really cute. Oh, on the stream? Oh, Inky needed to go to bed. I don't know about the other other Daddy, friends. I'm saying it. Owl hair is coming back whether you'll like it or not. Oh, okay. Okay. That that was the spoiler. That that's okay. That's I don't think that that's a a spoiler that people are going to be super upset about. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I think it, it I don't know. I, I know some people are, are a lot more sensitive about spoilers, but I'm not- I don't really care too much about spoilers, especially in Sky, because it's gonna be uh, revealed soon anyways, for a lot of them. And it's not like there's a huge like plot point reveal that's gonna change everything about how you view the game. It's just, oh, here's a cute cosmetic. Casually puts feathers in regular hair. Well, that's exciting. I was hoping it would be the deer mask. That's what I want. But if they're going to start bringing back ultimate gifts, then there's a chance that they could bring back other ultimate gifts. So I'm, I'm still not going to complain. Well, thank you for saving me the trouble from having to to translate the Morse code. Yeah, I did not know the word for owl in Italian. We need the deer mask from it. Please? Please? I knew about this game before it even came out for uh, for iPhone, and I was so excited for it. But I couldn't play it because I didn't I didn't have an iPhone. So by the time I got it, I literally it, like it was just impossible for me to ever get the deer mask. It was very tragic. Bunny is playing the house in Fata. What? <laughs> the house in Fata Morgan. What? an interesting sounding that must be an indie game man we really do have it's not a full server but it's almost a full server it's worth of people I don't know if anybody needs this shiny boy but if you do here you go Now's your chance. I gotta go have supper. I'll get the QR after. See ya. Okay, draw our gourmet. 
origami games. It was so good to meet you. I'll, um, I can send you a QR code in the Discord, or if you want to send me one in the Discord. Either way is totally fine. Have a good supper! Yeah, I think we got everything. You know what? Unshiny's your boy. <laughs> Lifeblood. How could you? This is blasphemy. You're a blasphemer. Oh, this darkness plant doesn't stand a chance. Not with so many people here. Sweet. I will change Crimson's name to Finley. Definitely need to remember to do that. Do we do we have everybody? No. Okay. There we go. Oh, we we lost somebody. We lost a tomato, I think. Going to lurk. Okay. Gotcha. No worries, tomato. Yeah, this- we've already done this level. We're just redoing it. Redoing it! wasn't exactly dancing, but it was close. Somebody made a full version of that song, and it is so stinking cute. I should share it in, in the Discord. Super cute. Oh wait, did you- did you need this shiny boy over here? Let's grab it for you, just in case. Don't tell me the switch is broken. Oh, there it goes. Oh, so many glitches that don't exist anymore. There used to be a glitch where you could just run right through that gate and phase right through it. It was so nice. Oh, hydrate. I see a hydrate. Okay. I see you, lifeblood. Thank you. Aw, Lovie. Are you going, Lovie? I 
Lovie wants to high five. There you go. It's like Lovie wants to high five somebody. Bye. Bye, Lovie. Yay, we did it. We did it twice. <laughs> Consume beverage. <laughs> oh, and a stretch. Okay. Oh, and another hydrate. Okay. I will stretch. I appreciate the this hair is so cute. It is. I love it. The, with the with the uh flower petals in it. I love it. Oh, wait. No, that's just the accessory, the flower crown. But yeah, no, no, no. The hair with the flower in it too is very cute. I appreciate y'all responsibly using the hydrate <laughs> and not just trying to drown me. <laughs> Alright, we've done we've done a lot today. But I think it would now be a good time to switch it over. Can I play two songs? Sure. We'll, we'll listen to you play your songs. And we'll, and after that, we'll go ahead and raid somebody. I would use the new hair, but this hair and mask combo is just too good. Oh, yeah. I see that. I can see that life flit. Sometimes it just doesn't mesh well. Like, the tiger mask plus this hair does not mesh well. Have a good one. Aw. See you, Uni. Oh. Bye. Thanks for joining. Oh, I tried. <laughs> you tried to drown me. Thanks, tomato. <laughs> okay, I think I think I know who I'm gonna raid after this. Um, there's a streamer that I followed the other day called Wooferdilly. And uh, she's very delightful. I think you'll have a fun time with her. Aww. That was pretty. Oh. <laughs> it was a pretty Rick roll. Now I'm doing Undertale. <laughs> oh, Panda, you fit right in. You you are not the first person to play the Rick Roll song <laughs> on stream. <laughs> I'm proud of you. <laughs> that was beautiful. Oh, perfect! Finley's here, so I can change. I can change their name to Finley. <laughs> I lost the game, Tomato again. No, Tomato. I'm so sorry. I started. I started this um, this curse and I feel like I have just perpetually cursed you now oh my gosh you and the meme songs Oh man, I never got an explanation from Blurst Sushi about why their name is Blurst Sushi. It's a mystery that will never be solved. Finley! Yes!
my flood was ready. <laughs> that song will instill the fear of God in you. <laughs> that was amazing. Ta da! <laughs> I love it. I love how much dedication <laughs> you brought to the meme. That was amazing. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Yay. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, well, that's about it. We did it. We did all the dailies twice. We went ahead and saw how much the, at least this cape costs. And we got it. And we did the uh, big candles in the vault. It's been fun. So I'll go ahead and I'll turn you over to, to Woo for Dilly. Uh, because um, they're a very delightful person. Who dis? That's Finley. That's Finley. Um, Finley's been joining some of my streams for a long time, but uh, recently, not so much. So it's good to see them again. Finley. Yeah, it's a Finley. Here, let me give let me give y'all a hug. Read I typed it here instead of on name. Oh no, Panda. <laughs> Finley. Oh no, Finley's typing. Okay. That's okay. Recently I was thinking. About name. Okay. That's why I'm Finley. Yes! Yeah, I think it was it was recently that, that Finley posted in the Discord about, about the name change. Oops. <laughs> that was an interesting hug. Okay. Yes, I'll turn y'all over to, to Woo for Dilly because they're a delightful person. I think, I don't know if they're new to streaming, but it seems like they stream pretty sporadically too, so I, I just want to give them a little support. 
Very sweet person. Alright. Still need to change my username in Twitch. Oh, no worries. Off I go to play Kerbo. Aw, oh, have fun! Bye bye. I'll see you later. Okay. Alright. Bye bye. Oh, wait, wrong. <laughs> wrong emoji, but okay. <laughs> bye. Oh, thank you for the follow, Frog, frog Oil. I love that name. Alright. We're we're going for real. Bye bye.